This is a new trailer update walk around. Just got a new trailer a week ago. This is a six and a half by 14. So it's got the toolbox in the front. Keep all my, my tool bag in there, spare parts. I got uh, automatic LED motion lights. They come on at night. My spare wands. Uh, this is a Magnum 8 gallon 3500 PSI hot water unit. A couple pump sprayers. 525 gallon water tank. Another toolbox in the back. Fire extinguisher. Uh, one and a half inch dump dump valve. And I have the Comet P40 gas soft wash system with a remote valve to turn off my bleach. <clears throat> and a 55 gallon vertical tank. And I have a three way valve here so that way when I'm done, I have a hose right here. I can just put in a five gallon bucket of water or if I want it downstream or spray something else, I can. I just gotta turn the valve to the one location or the other. Pull it down, it pulls bleach from the tank. Two GP hose reels, 200 feet of hose on each one. And I have an 18 inch hose reel for the gas off wash system with a 300 feet of half inch hose. And then over there I have my Predator 10 gallon a minute, 3200 PSI with a 12 gallon fuel tank. And I have the Flow Pro Solutions automatic bypass valve, remotely controlled, so that way I don't have to walk back and forth to the trailer to turn the valve to get full flow after I'm done downstreaming. Two spare 100 feet flexilla hoses. And on this side I have my hose fill, my tank fill hose. And I also have a inline filter for that. And then I have another uh, tank fill right here. If I need to double feed my tank, it also has an inline filter. Both of them have Hudson float valves inside. So if I need to double, double fill, then I'll use the Flexilla hoses for that. This right here is a low level switch. So when the water gets to a certain level, it'll automatically shut the pressure washer off. So that way I don't cavitate the pump. Got the, some chemicals. And then on this side, I got the I got a heat shield that I just put there just to protect the fuel tank from excessive heat. And then also I have a Flow Pro Solutions automatic bypass valve as well on this side. So both machines have it. Okay. So this is the walk around of the of the new trailer, pretty happy with it. Uh, I like having more room. My previous trailer was a five by 12 tandem. And with everything on there, I, it was pretty packed. I, I didn't have room to put this tank on here. This is the reason why I wanted this trailer so I could actually put a 500 gallon tank on here to be able to have more capacity for both machines. Uh, on my other machine, I had a, on my other trailer, I had a 330 gallon water tote. And it did good, but uh, the capacity just wouldn't hold up long enough in order to use both machines at the same time unless I was double feeding. All right, well, that's it. And then also, I have a digital meter on here. Let me know what my battery power is, and it also lets me know that the machine is charging. I have this on both of them. That's it.